I'm Ebony North for Investment Pitch Media. Thanks for joining us today. Q Battery Metals announced their exploration plans for 2023, which will focus on their lithium projects in Quebec. The initial program will target the company's Le Corne South Lithium Project, north of Val d'Or, in an area of the Abitibi Greenstone Belt of Rocks that hosts numerous deposits and mines. In particular, the area around the Le Corne Bathyllus hosts 16 documented lithium showings and two deposits. Nine lithium projects are located within 20 kilometers of the Le Corne South Project, including Siona's Mining North American Lithium Mine, a joint venture with Piedmont Lithium, which is just 11 kilometers northwest of Q Battery's Le Corne South Project. In June 2022, a formal agreement was announced by Siona to restart spodumene production at their North American Lithium Mine, which will ultimately include the development of a spodumene conversion facility to produce lithium hydroxide or lithium carbonate, as per Siona's agreement with the Quebec government to develop a local downstream processing capability in proximity to the North American battery market. Nine kilometers to the north of the Le Corne South Project, Siona Mining and Jordan Resources are planning an extensive diamond drilling program for 2023 to expand the Valley Lithium Deposit. Management cautions viewers that lithium resources that exist on properties outside of the Q Battery Metals claims are not direct indicators of lithium mineralization on the claims. The Q Battery claims cover 10 kilometers of the Le Corne Batholith and contacting volcanic rocks. Preliminary review of the rock sampling results from the 2021 Q Battery Metals Work Program indicated elevated lithium in the area of the Boli Barube mineral showing, which was documented as being associated with granitic pegmatites. This table summarizes rock samples from the Boli Barube that returned elevated lithium as high as 468 parts per million. One kilometer north of the Boli Barube showing in 2004, Falcon Bridge completed Diamond Drill Hole 0401, where core sampling returned up to 333 parts per million lithium over 1.5 meters at a depth of 186 meters. Lithium was not the targeted element during these previous exploration programs, and most historic drill holes did not analyze core for lithium. The Boli Barube showing has been prospected primarily for molybdenum, with discovery of elevated molybdenum and bismuth in quartz filled spar veins. In 1989, trenching and prospecting uncovered vein material at five locations in proximity to the Boli Barube showing. The veins were tested for molybdenum and copper. Q Battery Metals is currently contacting geophysical consulting companies to undertake a resistivity survey, which is demonstrated as capable of mapping pegmatite within the host volcanic rocks over the target area on the Le Corne South project. Prior surveying undertaken by Q Battery Metals included magnetics and conductivity surveys, which will be remodeled for features that might indicate pegmatite bodies. Follow-up to the geophysical surveying will include rock sampling of any available outcrops, along with soil sampling. The company plans to trench and drill the most prospective targets delineated from the 2023 exploration program. Drilling could be undertaken this summer. The shares are trading at 14.5 cents. For more information, please visit the company's website, qmetalscorp.com, or contact Richard Penn, CEO, at 778-384-8923. I'm Ebony North for Investment Pitch Media.